I swore to myself filming this video, I wasn't going to bring this up, but I feel like I kind of need to because I'm in so much pain. My wisdom tooth currently right now is protruding through my gums. Who wants to see? No one? Okay, fine. I'll show you. Ow! Yes, it is as painful as it looks. I currently do have a sharp bone. Me and Olivia were having this debate the other day. Is a tooth a bone? Because I thought teeth were bones, but she doesn't think they are. But what is a tooth then? A tooth? Hi! I'm filming an ASOS haul. Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a huge ASOS haul. I recently did a massive online order. They have so many beautiful pieces on there at the moment, so I just couldn't help myself. The lockdown boredom really did hit, and I have spent the entirety of the last four weeks online shopping. Oops, watch me act guilty about it, but I'm not at all. I, I don't feel guilty at all. We are actually just coming out of a lockdown into tier two, and as your girl is very excited about it. I will be eating at restaurants every single night of the week to make up for lost time. So I thought I would pick up some new pieces for the winter season. For the festivities, although none of this is very festive, I've also realized that I really need to start ordering clothes with color. Although I say that, I do have a few very spicy, colorful items. A few things a little different for me. I'm also feeling like this backdrop is very dark. Can I turn the lights on? Wow, we got a bit of a backdrop glow going on. So I did a massive Zara shop. Zara? Sorry, that was the last one, honey. I did a massive ASOS order and I've also got loads of the clothes in this. Ooh, the amount I flash my dress on the internet is actually terrifying. I got this little gold ear cuff. I think I want this bit pierced on my ear, so I thought I'd get an ear cuff to try it out first, and I'm enjoying, so sorry, Emma. Sorry, I'm not gonna talk about it any longer because I will have an angry voice note from my mum after this video. Love you. So, I think I thought I was doing something. First things first, obviously this is completely see-through. Like, you can literally see all my underwear right now. <laughs> I saw this on the model, and she looked so cool. But she's also a model, and I am not a model. Part of me is like, okay, fun, in Ibiza, but I don't live in Ibiza. I live in London. And I was thinking clubbing, party, moment. I don't even have the facilities. Oh, like, actually... I would turn around, but I can't. But let me know what you guys think. I think on holiday with a beautiful tan, I say this all the time, but it's only because I am, honestly, I haven't seen myself in my natural skin color for so long. So I'm kind of still adjusting to her. I don't know, I'm kind of undecided. Part of me wants to keep it because I'm thinking about holiday. But I know Olivia will also roast me for this because I'm pretty sure it's got like butterflies on it. Oh my God. I still forget that we have a cat. So I hear a bang and I'm like, <laughs> It was just the cat. I think we've been looking at this for long enough now. Next one? Yeah, I agree. Next thing I got is this bodysuit, which I am really enjoying. You do have to wear a bra underneath it because it is pretty see-through. So I have just got like a little, you guys know, lacy bra. You know the you know the drill by now. But I think it's so cute. It's got like a little cut out here. As I said, it is a bodysuit, so it does go down the back just looks like this probably got so much back fat and like bra straps that need adjusting but shh, we don't have to focus on that one there is a little bit more skin on show with this one but i mean we are all mature women here we don't shame showing skin on youtube.com forward slash flossy you wear whatever makes you feel comfortable thank you for coming to my ted talk i'm really enjoying really cute with a little pair of jeans maybe like a club vibe or maybe just a nice dinner with like a big blazer over That's it. That's the tweet. I'm also not wearing lip liner today, and this is real character development from me. Fun fact, I actually have a weird thing about applying lip liner. If you ever spend a day with me, I put on lip liner a criminal amount. I'm not the biggest fan of my lips, so I usually always wear lip liner, but I actually forgot to put it on today. And is it weird if I go to put lip liner on halfway through a video? Does anyone even care? Does anyone even notice? That's the real question. I'm on a weird one today. I've either had too much cough 
Ooh. I've either had too much coffee or not enough. The next thing I got is this little skirt. Don't get me wrong, I love this skirt. It's got like a really interesting sort of waistband. I don't know if you can see that, but it's kind of got a split here and then it goes dipped here. But it is so short. I actually can't turn around in it because the bottom of my bum cheek are out and that is not appropriate. I am trying to stay monetized over here, but I really have high hopes for it. Like, I just don't really know how you're supposed to wear it. I'm really confused because like surely it's supposed to sit on your waist and then go slightly below your waist confused.com period the hair is up people it's getting serious well it's getting serious it's also getting bloody warm in this room honestly filming try on hauls is actually like my weekly exercise Oh my god, that's really bad. This next item I got, kind of similar to the last black bodysuit. I am wearing a bra underneath this, but I have actually worn this out already. I say out, like literally out on a walk. That is really what our lives have come to, wearing a black lacy bodysuit on a walk. And you don't have to wear a bra with it, but under really harsh studio lights, I just would rather not take that risk. It's got like this crossover section here. It's like kind of a bra tie-up clasp at the back. I just really enjoy it. I feel like everyone needs a lot of black, cute, lacy bodysuits in their wardrobe because they're just so easy to dress up, dress down, as you hear every YouTuber ever say. And I hope the people in Battersea Park also enjoyed it. I did have a massive puffer on. I'm not an absolute weirdo like going out in just a bodysuit and jeans on a walk. I'm actually really, I'm getting really insecure about my outfit choice for that walk now, okay? Next outfit. Do not judge my choice of top with this outfit. I literally just grabbed the closest sort of little top to me. A print. I know, you never thought you'd see the day, but here we are. 2020 has been a wild one. Wow, a wild one. How appropriate, because wild horses, well, I'm assuming they're wild. Are they even horses or are they cows? Yeah, definitely horses. Really thought I just bought a jacket with cows on it then. But would a jacket with cows on it be better than a jacket with horses on it? I tried this outfit on and came into Olivia's room to show her and she did say it's radiating horse girl energy, which I mean is pretty appropriate considering it is a matching, hold on, let me scurry you down. It is a matching horse cohort. It fits really badly because it is men's. <laughs> um, I'm just not sure. I'm not sure. This is from Jaded. I think it's really cool. Like, look at the back of it. I know Lewis has got these trousers. I hope he's not mad at me that I bought the same trousers as him. Is this cool or is this just so much horse girl energy? I really should have put on this little brown top here. Like, imagine it with this. Now I look like I'm going on a safari. Uh, this is from the men's section from Jaded. So the fit of the trousers is a little bit off. It's like really tight on my hips, as you can see here. It's like being stretched over my hip. But then it is quite roomy on the waist, which I really don't mind, actually. I'd always rather have room on the waist of trousers. I hate it when they're really tight and you're like spilling out of it. It's just something I don't need to be dealing with day to day. You know what I mean? It's just that worst thing. Ow. Oh my God. Oh. The back of my mouth is so swollen, like the gum is so swollen from this wisdom tooth that I keep just biting it and it's the most painful thing in the world. I mean, I will be keeping it. It's just whether I wear it. I hate myself. Why do I spend money on stuff like this? But she's cool. Is she? I honestly think I am the man from Split. Like, I just have so many different opinions on things. I'm gonna get Lewis's opinion on this one, and I'll get back to you in three to five working days. Now, a moment of silence for the thing I was most excited and the thing that spurred me on to do this ASOS haul. I got this beautiful little black dress, satin, you guys know. I love satin slip dresses. I own a criminal amount, but here I am buying more. It's a hobby, okay? It's what I collect. I could be addicted to worse things, the shut your mouth. It's this beautiful little black satin underwired lacy cami. It's got a little cutout, perfect length, so cute. It came broken. Honestly, just a really sensitive topic. I'm still coming to terms with it myself, so I don't really feel like I'm ready to open up about it on the internet yet. I saw really Hannah in this dress on Instagram and I just needed it and it was out of stock for ages. It finally came back in stock. But I mean, little bit of a problem because one of the whole entire straps are missing. I honestly think if I was a dress, I would be this. 
That was a reach. Okay, so these next few pieces I'm gonna show are actually all jaded pieces, which are sold on ASOS, but I got these from the jaded website. I got these jeans, which I think are so cool. Now, I have never and will never be a low-waisted jeans kind of gal. As you can see, <laughs> she says literally wearing a pair of low-waisted jeans. Now, these jeans are low-waisted, but you can buy these kind of like boxer-style shorts to go underneath them, and I just think it looks so cool, and it's a really fun way to wear low-waisted if you don't actually want to wear low-waisted you know what I mean wow take a shot every time I say low-waisted you will be on the ground or in the ground I like these super wide leg jeans they're really cool they've got like a little strap here just like loads of fun detail I don't really wear fun clothes but I feel fun and I think the fact I'm using fun to describe them potentially says a lot about my level of fun I've been having these last four weeks. If you can't tell, I am going a bit insane. It is day three inside the house and I'm not gonna talk about it. It also comes with this little matching top you can wear. This one is a little bit big, so I feel like trying it on, I can't really do it justice. Look at me go. Fun. Next thing I got are these really fun cloud jeans. I feel like everyone's seen the jaded cloud print. I got these in a size up from my usual size because as I said, I like to have things slightly bigger around my waist. And I also sometimes like it when I can pull it down so it's like just below my waist. I just really enjoy it. There's not really much to say about them. They're like a really nice baggy fit. I said goodbye to the mum jeans a long time ago. I go for straight leg or wide leg now only. Potentially put a flare in the mix every now and then but that is a rare occasion. I love, really fun. Fun? Oh my god, stop saying fun. Wow. They did it again. She said cozy. I didn't have to go that hard, but I did. I love it. I feel so fluffy, so cozy, but not like a tramp. And I do feel like a tramp sometimes in matching like jogger sets. This is a really cool Borg fleecy, loud, co-ord jogger set. For once, the top I put on is actually going with something. I'm so proud of myself. Good job. Future editing flossy, give yourself a pat on the back. Good job, honey. You ex you excelled. I actually do think I excelled in this haul. It was literally all the most basic clothing ever. Okay, we're talking about it again. Really enjoying. It's honestly so soft. I love how like oversized it is with all the gold jewelry as well. I always say every time I try something on, loads of gold jewelry, and guess what? I'm wearing loads of gold jewelry today. She came prepared. I am really enjoying. I think this is so delicious and so cute and just so fun. Um, it has a little like drawstring here so you can tighten it if you fancy, but I will be wearing this for the foreseeable future. So everyone, that is the end of my haul video. I really hope you guys did enjoy it. I will try and leave links to everything down below. Let me know which pieces were your favorite if you are gonna pick up any that I showed. I have all my social medias and everything listed in the description box down below. I'm most active on my Instagram so if you want to keep up to date with my thrilling life which actually will probably be getting a little bit more thrilling now that we're back a little bit more normal there's so much fluff lying around in the air right now can you see that so much fluff I love you all so much I hope you are all safe and well and I will see you all very very soon bye they're sharing a call or bird box. Okay. Love you. Bye. <laughs>